Hello my dear friends, I'm Kirill and today I'd like to show you my new motorized model. This is a LEGO Technic set 42151 Bugatti Bolid. As always I tried to keep the original look of the model as much as possible. The only one thing that has been changed intentionally is an air intake. I didn't like the original one, it was too bulky to my mind. And the rest of the model has almost no changes. I even still can open a driver's door to show you a seat and a steering wheel. I hope you can see it. Uh, a place of the second seat is occupied by a steering servo motor here. And here there is no space for an opening mechanism of the right door, but it's still possible, for example, to open the front compartment. And here we can see a steering gear. In the original set, the steering angle was significantly limited. I removed the central beam to improve maneuverability, but it was a bad idea because the surrounding pieces are too close to wheels. And now, now you can see uh, that front wheels touch the chassis on both sides, here and here. Once again, yeah. So it's necessary to rebuild the front part of the model to fix this problem. In the rear part of the model you can see Buiz motor and Buiz receiver. The model has direct drive. It's very efficient, but the clearance is about 1, maybe 1.5 millimeters. It sounds a bit dangerous, but on a flat surface the car rolls perfectly. The receiver is mounted just above the motor, something like this. Yeah, I hope you can see it. It was not too easy to place to fit these components, but I like uh, the result and I still have an access to a charging connector, so it's really convenient. I tried to mount the motor diagonally to improve the clearance, but there was no space for the receiver in this case. And during this attempt I realized that this part of the Bugis motor is formed more conveniently than the original buggy motor that has more massive shape without any purpose. You can see that the Bugis receiver is visible here and I was forced to remove the second yellow beam because there was no space. At the end of the video you will find a short test drive. Please share your thoughts about my model below the video. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!